I want to help you be able to graph lines in WebAssign. We have two equations, x minus y equals 10 and 3x plus y equals 10. So two equations. I should have two lines. Now they may be the same line, and if that is the case, we will have infinite solutions on that line. But right now, I'm going to graph the first one, and then I'm going to graph the second one. For x minus y equals 10, I need two points. Now, if you want to know how to get these two points, you need to refer to my website, www.lovealgebra.com, and look under the tab, Graphing Lines. My two points for the first line will be 0, negative 10, and 3, negative 7. So, in my graph area, in my coordinate plane, I will come right over here to grab this line. Now, you see, I could grab a ray or just a line segment, but I do want the line. I could just put the point on here. I think we said 0, negative 10. That would be right there. But notice, it shows up down here. So I could have just typed it in. Let me scroll down for you all to see this. The other point was 3, negative 7. So once again, I could just go to 3. I could go down to negative 7. And there is my line. But I did not have to find the point. I could have just typed these points in. Now remember, we didn't have just one line. We had two lines. This is a system of equations. So I need to find two points that are on this line. The two points I found were 0, 10, and 3, 1. So I will grab that line. I'm going to just type these in. So I will have 0 for my x, 10 for my y, and 3 for my x, and 1. And it graphed it for me. So it looks like these two lines, I do have just one solution. It looks like it would be at 5, negative 5. So I do have one solution, 5, negative 5. I will submit my answer, and it is correct. So once again, to graph a line, you grab the line. Then you can type in two points down here. Or just find the point, click, find the second point, click, you have your line.